Um, okay, no, no ums. Blech. My throat, I'm feeling so dehydrated, but I'm fasting so I can't drink water. Oh. Hey guys, um, welcome back to another video. Oh my gosh, I'm on a roll behind the scenes, even though you haven't seen much going on. I have literally been recording every day for the last two days so far but I'm hoping to record a lot more videos in the future because I have a ton of YouTube um, videos planned for the future so stay tuned for that but basically today I'm going to be doing a life update video because the last time I did one was in January January yeah so after my first semester in university and now I have finally finished first year of university so everything is very different so get comfy get your snacks um chill somewhere where you can chill you know lie down sit up do whatever you need to do to get comfortable and stay tuned for this video so like my last video, how I kind of separated the video into like different sections and talked about different topics, I'm going to do the same in this video so that you guys can grasp what's going on in the different aspects of my life. So the first thing I'm going to be talking about today is a university. Obviously my channel has been dominated by my uni vlogs and I'm so thankful thank you so much to all of you who have been watching and especially you consistent ones because I do see you guys but as you can clearly see the university has ended well for the year yeah for the year it's it's really crazy thinking about the fact that I've finished first year because all your life throughout secondary school maybe primary school but that's a bit too young secondary school sick form college wherever you go you're always told, told about university, you're always told, oh my gosh, you need to get the grades, to get into university, da, 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 to get to university. University is on the top of the pedestal, basically. And now that you're there, it's like, oh. I think a lot of the time, university is hyped so, so much. And it's like, this great thing, oh my gosh, you will finally make it, da, 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 da. And then when you make it, you're like, this is it. Maybe when I finish university, I might realize I've gone to university, but right now it actually doesn't feel like I've gone to university. I don't know, it just feels like an extension of school in a weird way, if you understand what I mean, because obviously you become independent, you have to do a lot of adulting and stuff, but you really just get on with it and you get used to it, which is crazy because I never would have expected it. My first year, definitely, if I had to summarise it in one word, I would call it a roller coaster. Literally, ups and downs, twists and turns, and new things happening at every corner. Like, you literally can't go through one week of university without something just popping up and messing up the week. That doesn't necessarily mean that it has to be a bad thing, but there are curveballs thrown left, right and centre, so literally you can never go through university on a smooth sailing ship, if you get what I mean. I definitely think it was a roller coaster, both mentally and physically, I guess, because physically you're up and down, running up to your lectures, going all these different places, maybe you're going out and stuff, having fun, party, party. <laughs> Um, so you're always kept on your toes but mentally and that's definitely um, where the biggest challenge comes from you're all over the place in terms of your emotions and I think when people usually say a lot about oh university really take care of your mental health it's really important it's going to be mentally challenging a lot of the time you don't realize it until you actually get there and you're like oh my gosh everything that they've said to me is actually true but it was a great experience because looking back at it now 
I did so much and I'm really glad that I'm someone who's very proactive and like tries to make the most out of every situation, every opportunity because I'm not paying 9.25k a year for me to sit at home and watch Netflix all day when I could do that for free at home. Really make the most of these opportunities. If there's a, I don't know, an interesting lecture popping up and you're like, whoa, I'm interested in what they're talking about, let me go and watch, um, go, go ahead and attend do that if they're having an event you're interested go to it you know why it's free to you because you're at university but when you leave university they're gonna get that coin and they want you to spend that moolah and mm -mm, i ain't about to pay so make sure you spend that money mm -mm, spend that money spend that time wisely and make sure that you invest in all the things and opportunities that come around to you because 9k my friend, 9k, 9.25k, because Theresa May, Theresa May, I see you girl. I've learned from university that I need to obviously be very organised um, and prioritise. So there's so much going on, like I said earlier, that you're not going to have time to do everything and if you do, then you need to make sure that you cover your basis first make sure you do the essentials and then you can do all the rest remember you're going to university to get your degree and to get your good degree you need to study your books so make sure you do that first and then everything else comes afterwards I will probably make another video and it is in the works talking about all my advice experience blah blah in relation to university because that is a whole topic in itself i just wanted to give you a brief um synopsis i guess synopsis look at me using their uni language <laughs> but i just wanted to give you a brief overview of just how um uni has been where i'm at now in terms of my university journey and where I plan to go, well, I plan to take second year in its stride. Luckily, I don't have to worry about a lot of the stuff that I worried about in first year, so it should be a bit easier in that sense. Academically, though, mm -mm. oh hell no! Next up, let's talk about summer. So obviously, now that my university um, journey for first year has ended. It's summertime, baby. This summer, I am trying to work, work, work and make that money because um, university is... <laughs> wow. University is financially crippling. Um, university is where you learn how to be broke. Being broke is actually a lifestyle. Um, so... I'm making as much money as I can to help um, add on to my student loan. Yeah, student loan does not cut it, guys. So if you don't work, I'm praying for you. I am praying for you. But at the same time, I don't want to work every single day. I actually want to spend summer actually relaxing, you know, and chilling because that's what summer is about. So hopefully this summer I will be doing actual holiday activities like going out, having fun, etc. but still working alongside and making my money. Next up, let's talk about YouTube because obviously that is where you're watching me. This channel, right? All you've ever seen are my uni vlogs and they're great. They're so much fun to record. They're very easy to record and they're really fun to edit. However, that means you've only seen like one side of me and that's why I like to have these sit down talking videos once in a while because it's great just to be able to talk to you guys and say hi this is Hattie in the flesh and I'm not running around and doing all this stuff and you can just pay attention to me I'm a very talkative person I like to talk I like to chat I like to give advice so that expect that kind of stuff on my channel if you want to like if you want some Q&A's, if you want some advice corners, like hit your girl up all you've ever seen our vlogs. So I'm trying to like diversify and do different things. I love obviously doing uni videos and like letting you guys know about my experience at university. And one of the main reasons why I kind of started that was because I realized that there are not many 
black individuals like myself on um, online representing, um, especially for, for my university. I study at University of Edinburgh, if you don't know, you should know, get to know. Um, but especially for my university, there are hardly any um, YouTubers, I guess. It's just like such a disconnect. And so I just really wanted to do that for people. I really wanted other BME individuals to watch my videos and to say, okay, so if one of us is there, we can all make it there. I just really wanted to be there for you guys and just provide advice and provide my experience, tell you what to do and what not to do, what well, not tell you, but advise you. The main reason why I made this channel, like I said, was to just help individuals like yourselves during like get some insight to what university is like for a BME student living or well, studying in Scotland because like Scot the Scottish experience is very different to the English experience. Ultimately I just want to help make another person's experience easier and well informed and more informed um, as a matter of fact. And obviously that's one reason why I'm ACS president at the University of Edinburgh. Please make sure you sign up for next year because it's going to be lit. Um, <laughs> um, because like I said, I really care about helping you guys and making sure that you're all um, well and good and have the best opportunities irrespective of the colour of your skin. So my channel is not necessarily going to be geared to one thing. It's not going to be a beauty channel, it's not a lifestyle channel, it's not, I don't know, it's not an education channel, it's an all-rounder. So I, one day I might do a fashion haul, one day I might do a hair routine, which I have recorded, so stay tuned for that. I just want to be versatile and I just want to be me, so if you subscribe to the fact that you like me or if you like my personality my charisma uniqueness nerve and talent shout out to you guys if you know where that's from um then please make sure you subscribe for all the upcoming adventures from moi i have a couple videos planned and like i said if you just see here there are um videos planned for um summer so i've got a couple of uni videos well quite a few uni videos planned especially because it's summer just before september october when students are the new cohort no, no the new cohort of students are starting so i want to give you as much advice and help you as much as i can before that happens because i know a lot of you will be on the internet on youtube trying to find some advice but seeing requests that of videos that you guys put forward um those are all put down here in this book for upcoming video titles that i'm going to not video titles but upcoming videos which i'm going to film um so expect some information about my accommodation maybe a room tour and all that kind of jazz also like some fun videos like story times and stuff which obviously you can definitely do based on university because university is one big the amount of stories and you hear in university but also the amount of experiences which can make story times crazy i've been talking for ages i don't know how long this video is because one of the downfalls of recording on an iphone is you can't really see yourself and you can't see the time yeah so i'm trying to get a camera one day um i'm trying to get a camera soon so that's another reason why i need to work expect some great content coming up soon i just wanted to film like a life update video now so that when the new content comes up so like all the non-vlog content comes up you guys have some idea of what's going on how can i not discuss this okay so thank you so much for all of you people who have subscribed to my channel and thank you to all you guys who leave comments and stuff i feel like i haven't actually sat down and given you appreciation and thank you so much for i think it's 290 subscribers Phew, mind blown so thank you so much for that i'm nearly at 300 so get me there soon um and hopefully we can make some magic so i'm just gonna wrap things up right now and end this video make sure you like comment and subscribe because you need to get your girl to 300 so i'm gonna duck and dive Ooh, 
I'm going to duck and dive and I'll see you in another video. Bye. Why was that? Bye. Bye. No. No. Bye.